All right, so I have a guy here <clears throat> interested in an SI. So I'm able to drive another SI. Look both ways. Clutch in, gas. Second gear. Man, these things are fun, man. Well, see, I didn't even press the gas. Auto rev matching. Dude, these things are so much fun. Two miles. Two miles on this thing. Look at that. Look at that. Hell yeah. Absolutely insane day today. I had one, two, two uh, deliveries scheduled a few days ago. And then I had another delivery scheduled today from yesterday. And then I just sold another car. So I almost had four cars out today, man. At one point, I had like three to four people at once. Dude, I've never been so busy in my life. It is insane. I just got a break. I haven't even eaten lunch yet. It's 526. I'm going to go home and chill the fuck out, man. Insane. All right, good morning. It is the 31st, the last day of 2023. I am, it is Sunday. I'm on my way to church. I'm going to go to church, meet uh, the fellow who I sold the passport to, gave me that Bible. Oh, drop my phone. Hold on. Just driving, trying to get there. Check over there, we're all good. So, I'm headed to church, we'll go eat, go do that, eat lunch. And then my plan for today is to just kind of work on the fit all day. There's a bad squeal on the belt for some reason. I'm not too not too sure why. I don't know if it's a belt itself. I don't know if it's a tensioner. I don't know if it's what it is. But I have some people wanting to come pick it up on Tuesday. Uh, so Sunday today, Monday tomorrow, then Tuesday. So I'll have to see what I can do to fix that. Then I'm going to rotate the tires. And then I think I'll be all good for this car. Maybe not cleaning, but I don't know. Probably not. They're not giving me everything I want, and they're, they've been kind of a pain in the ass to deal with, so probably, I probably won't even clean it. I won't clean it. But yeah, I'll try to fix the belt and then rotate the tires. So even if they don't buy it, then I'll have rotated tires and I'll have that belt fixed. So it'd be a perfectly fine car for me to keep on driving, which honestly, I don't mind driving because this thing hasn't had a single issue other than that belt, belt squeal. It gets me great gas mileage. It's a manual, so it's fun to drive. But I do have another car that I want to go try and pick up. That would be my daily for a while. So let's go. And that's a 2015 Jetta GLI. Like my previous 16, the only big differences are it doesn't have the blind spot and it doesn't have the lighting package, unfortunately. But I think I'm going to just get over, I think I'm going to get some VLAN headlights for it anyways. And then a cold air intake, coilovers, all that fun jazz. But, uh... Yeah, in the meantime, let's go do this. All right, so it didn't need a belt. It just needed tighten. This little tensioner right here, it just needed the belt tighten. And then once we tightened it, it quit the squealing. So I'm gonna go drive real quick to make sure it's all good. And then this thing's 100% ready to rock and for the new customer to drive off in. And uh, I actually bought something else. It's my first Toyota. I'll make a video. I also bought that. Shit, I still need to make a video on that. That thing's a piece of shit. I'm upset I bought it, but that's whatever. So I got the inside of the uh, exterior cleaned up for the most part. I could still wipe down like a few things, but as far as like floor mats go and all that stuff, I got most of it cleaned up. I'm going to get the windshield replaced Tuesday. I'm going to go wash it right now and then post post yeah go wash it take pictures post it park it at the lot and then i think i'll be good with this one for now until tuesday comes and then i'll replace the windshield and i think we're pretty good yeah i've just been doing a lot today i fixed the tensioner on the fit then i went and parked that at the at the shop and then I, yeah, I came back, cleaned this up, and now I'm going to go wash this, and then I'll take pictures of this, and then I'll post this. 
then I'll go park it at the lot and then we'll be all set for this one. So um, I'm trying to get this all done before the Chiefs game starts here soon. So let me go. Let's just go do this. Okay, well, about this Toyota literally fucking two days ago. And I think I already have some guys sold on it. So let's, uh, let's go do this. All right, so I bought this 2001 Toyota Camry on Saturday. Today is Monday? Today's Monday? Hold on. Monday. I bought this on Saturday. I've had it Saturday evening, Sunday, now today. It's a 2001 Toyota Camry LE in uh, magnificent shape. And I already have someone here coming to buy it. I bought it for 35. I'm selling it for 49. Clean as fuck. Only got 137,000 miles. No lights or anything. Two keys and two key fobs that work. It has a 2.2. This thing's clean as fuck, man. And I uh, sold it for what? $1,400 in profit. And, um, Two, two and a half days. Yeah, two and a half days. It's got title and everything there. So, it's clean as hell. It's a good fucking car. I just realized something. I never put gas in this. I never put a single drop of gas in this car. Oh. God, it's got power mirrors, windows, locks, radio. Only 137,000 miles? This thing's a beast! What a first car.